right, guys. Today we are going to be talking about silk wraps. Um, it's a type of protection that you put on top of your laptop, um, phones, other things like that. Um, so I got mine for the MacBook Pro here, and um, I'm pretty excited. Anyway, I'll pull it out. I'll, I'll let you guys see what it looks like. But um, I'm gonna do just kind of like a how-to video on this, and then also my first first impressions on what I think about it, um, and see if you guys would like to uh, maybe. Uh, purchase some later. Uh, I just want to say I have no affiliation with with uh, slick wraps I just was really wanting to get some protection for my device I also have some other videos on how to install some other things. I, I had gotten uh, Pads right here on on my laptop to kind of protect um, You know when, when you put your hand on top or the mouse track or the mouse pad right here So there's a there's gonna be a link in the uh, in the bottom down here as far as uh, how to see that video. So let's go ahead and get started here. Um, this here is uh, the uh, slick wraps that I got in the mail. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you these. All right, so that there is, uh, is the, the wood. Um, it's kind of bad lighting right now, but hopefully once I put it on top of the laptop, I'll let you guys see what it's gonna look like. Um, but that that actually looks really good. Um, I really like that. So Anyway, let's get this open Okay, so here's the top um, I don't know if you can actually see there's like an Apple logo right inside right here um, So if you want you're able to just pop it out and I also like the bottom here that looks nice and good So I'm pretty excited. It looks like they gave you um, just kind of like a little uh, almost like a credit card type thing that you, you can use to push it on. Um, they gave me microfiber cleaning cloth. That video that I was talking about where I did the other install, they did not include this. I was actually pretty surprised that they didn't do that. So I'm glad that they did that. And uh, I think that's about it inside of here. Okay. So let's go ahead and get this installation going on for you guys. Let's try and get this, uh, this one installed right here. Now from watching the videos, they always said to kind of maybe peel maybe a quarter of the way or peel halfway and kind of fold it. So I'll kind of show you guys what they're, uh, what I mean by that. And uh, right about there, I'm gonna just fold it. And then uh, we are gonna go and we're gonna try and line this up as close as we can. All right, so I got it all the way up to here now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start taking off this Apple logo right here. Oh, that actually came off pretty easily. Okay, so now um, all we really need to do is we just start pulling right here, and uh, this should start laying down pretty nice and easy. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna put my hand here, just slide it out, and just put my finger down. Gonna make sure that looks good. Look at that. That looks good. Making sure my bottom still looks good, my top. That was, uh, that was almost too easy. Okay, all right, so let's go ahead and turn this guy over. And uh, so now this is the bottom piece right here. Now if you look, there are these uh, little notches in here. That's supposed to line up with this part right here. There's that black hinge on the MacBook Pro. And so that's lining up right there. And then obviously these holes right here line up with these guys. Now, um, one thing that is pretty nice, I don't know if you can see, there's these little screw heads kind of going all the way around. They actually made holes for each screw head. That way, um, if you ever need work done on your MacBook Pro, you can actually unscrew those and take this off without having to take this layer off. So very, very considerate of uh, slick wrap. So um, let's go ahead and start popping this on. I took those all off um, and so we should be ready to go. So same thing, remember, we are going to peel this halfway. or close to halfway, and we're just gonna fold it like that. So now we are gonna wanna try and line these up as best as we can. Sometimes these holes right here, they don't quite match up, and you can actually kinda see that right now. Um, they're not quite matching up, but if we were to look at the actual bottom, it is lining up perfectly. So um, even though that these are not, don't worry, 
Um, the nice thing is that these are on the bottom and so you don't really have to worry about it too much. Um, I do kind of wish that it was perfect, but I mean, again, for how much of a discount that I got these, I'm, I'm not really too worried about it. And then um, in the instructions, they do say that as far as the corners go, you want to take like a nice heat source so um, a blow dryer would work just fine. And so I'm going to go grab one and we're going to uh, heat these sides up. That way they lay nice and flat. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab that. All right. Nice. So that, that side went down nice and good. And... Uh, uh, the rest of this I should be able to get pretty easily, so. All right, guys. That looks really good. I don't know if you can see the corners. They're, uh, they're standing down nice and good now. So, um... Either way though, that's that's the end product right there. That's uh, what it's supposed to look like. And then there's the, uh, the Apple logo on the top. That just looks really good. I really like that. Taking a look here. Is guys, that is the end product right there. Um, this looks so good. I really do like the look of this. Um, taking a look underneath. Um, Kind of like what I was talking about. So this one matched up nice and good. This one was okay. However, these guys over here, they did not line up very good. Uh, but if you take a closer look on the edge, I mean, it it's basically just, just about as good as you can get. Um, and these guys, it's pretty darn close. I mean, yes, it is off slightly, but considering that... Uh, this is going to be protecting my device. This is going to be offering a lot of protection from scratches. Um, obviously not drops, but um, you know the it, it's going to help keep that resell value um, when I try and you know when I want a new MacBook Pro later down the road and I want to turn around and flip this. This is going to do a lot of good for me. All right, guys. So that is my review on the slick wrap um, and uh, an installation on it. Again, I really do like this. I think it's gonna look really nice. Um, just, I feel like it has a nice, um, I guess professional feel to it. Um, and it's not gonna be degrading my experience at all. I also um, just wanna say the, the type of wood style that I got is called ebony. So if you're ever curious, hop on to Slick Wraps. Ebony is the one I went with. If you, if you like the look of this, um, as much as I do, I, I mean, it's it's a just beautiful, beautiful wood uh, style here. So um, anyway, uh, let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this video. If uh, there's anything I can do to improve on it or any other how-to videos, just comment below and let me know. And I will try my best to go out and do those for you. Um, other than that, I think we are good to go. Like comment, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you next time, okay? See you guys, peace.